first chapter. Lesson number three. The basic parameters of your show. Part two. See the third tab, the background. Click on to open it. In this tab, you can set the basic wallpaper for all your show. Remember that you can edit to your liking, no matter what the time, but, also, slide by slide. On the right side, you have five inserts. The first in the top left, as the watermark is the preview window in your show, as the film will be created. Just below it, the selector tab for style of background. Background source. You can select three types of wallpaper. First, solid color, or united color. Your wallpaper will be the uniform color of your choice. The second, gradient, or gradient colors, you can give wisp to graded, to, or multicolored, in different styles, and direction, to your wallpaper. Last, image, as its name implies, select an image file or photo as wallpaper. Still below, the tab edit of the selected file. It contains commands sizing your file, scrolling, rotation, rotate, effect mirror, flip, and coloring fair of, colorize. Above right, the preview image file, gradient, or original color used. And finally, below it, the inset of basic photo settings, for your wallpaper. Adjustment. You will notice that all orders are not necessarily accessible. It is that if the file type, or style used, permit it. See all this with concrete examples. First, the option solid color. Select it by clicking on the box round to the left. The original color is black. See how modify it. Just to the right of the preview of the selected color, you have a button set. Click to open the color picker. Above it, you have two buttons, cancel, and set color. The first allows you to leave the selector without color changes, and the second, to apply the color you selected. You have a small preview of color in court, in this small triangle, just below the set color button. First, select the desired color on the RGB mixing circle, clicking to the location of the desired shade. Then, in the triangular chart, you can set the intensity of light, and color saturation. Click on the chosen location. Once your specified color, click on set color, the color selector closes and the color is applied to your background. You have the preview in the preview window and in the window current show background, which also tells you the type of background used. Here, solid color background, and in the center of the preview, his name, color. You have no other settings possible for this type of wallpaper. See the second option, Gradient. Click the round box to the left of the name to select it. You will notice that directly, your wallpaper will be changed and replaced by a gradient black and white horizontal. We will edit this gradient color, or, gradient. To do this, you have a button control named, Edit Gradient. Click above to open the editing windows of it. We will not detail here all the commands of this window, it will be an entire lesson. Just for example, above right, you have a insert, gradient type, and a drop-down menu, type. It is now about linear. Click to open, and select, plasma. You now have a gradient effect same as cloud. In the left inset, preset, click the desired color. You can do many tests, as they say, it's in forging that one becomes a blacksmith. Once obtained your choice, click, OK, to apply it to your show, or, cancel, to exit the editor without changes. You can see the result in the preview window graphics, as well as in the current show background, which also displays the type of background.
It is now gradient background. Same as for solid color, no other option of Edotames is available for a wallpaper gradient. See the third option, Image. Same as the first two, click the round checkbox to the left the name to select it. To the right of the name you have three buttons, Browse, to open the file explorer, and import an image. The symbol, minus, to delete the selected image, will be removed from your show, but not from your computer. The third is used to edit your image in an external program. Choose, browse, and click. In the menu that comes from opening, choose select image file, and click it. The files explorer window opens. Preferably, always try to choose an image the same size as your show. Click the file to select it, then on open to bring it into your show. Your image now appears in the two preview windows, as is appears in your show, and in its original form. And, the file name used. The editing tools menu is now accessible. Under, Scaling, you can define the ways in which your image will adapt in your show. The option, Fit to Frame, allows you to stretch your image edge to edge screen. It is most often used. We will see other options in lesson, editing an image. Rotate, you can give by quarter turn rotation to your image. Rotation is counterclockwise, it the anti-clockwise. Flip, the two commands allow you to give a mirror effect horizontal and or vertical in your image. And function, colorize, colorizing fair of. We will also see in the lesson on editing images. Like the menu adjustment, which allows the adjusting saturation, contrast, black and white levels, and hardness of your image, and a color shift function for of. We see the last tab, soundtrack, in the next lesson. Thanks for your attention.